Hello everyone, welcome back here to the channel Stapa Olho Azul and Super Academico and today in our English video of the week I'm going to make some comments and connections to the Netflix series The Fall of the House of Usher based on the works of Edgar Allan Poe Before I begin, I would like very much that you subscribe to the both channels yeah? and ring the bell for notifications and also comment and share the video also I would like to you to take a look to this spot I will run now is about uh, support that you can give to our channel uh, to the channel Super Academic in case just Super Academic uh, where you can support the channel to grow uh, to grow more and give you contents in several subjects Let's go to the spots. Então, vamos ajudar o super acadêmico aqui no Apoia-se. É só você clicar aí na primeira link da descrição que você chega lá no Apoia-se e pode apoiar o canal a partir de um real. Agora você pode ajudar com um pouquinho mais com essa nova premiação aqui com o meu novo livro Sex Celebridades. Se você apoiar a partir de 40 reais, apenas 40 reais, você ganha como recompensa um exemplar aqui do livro Sex Celebridades, os Relatos Secretos do Abel Marx e Sua Experiência com Garotos de Programas, disponível no Clube de Autores. Você pode também pedir ele pelo Clube de Autores, que é o segundo link na descrição do vídeo. Mas apoiando o canal no Apoia-se, você vai ter direito a ele de graça. Né? Apenas apoiando o canal e aí você tem direito a um exemplar. Então, vá lá, clica no link e apoia o canal. Agora vamos ao conteúdo do vídeo. So this is the, the link né, the, for the support, the Apoia-se uh, site that you can support our channel here in the Super Academico. Tapa Olho Azul, not yet, but Super Academico you can support and even you can get a book in Portuguese, a book in Portuguese, but you can get this book here, here, this book here. Well, other uh, books too, other books too. Um, first of all, I'd like to I'd like to call the attention about uh, the title of the series, uh, the, the Fall of the House of Usher. Uh, I, I read the short story by Edgar Allan Poe, uh, The Fall of the House of Usher, which is uh, a very simple thing: is a uh, two men talking about the decay of a family, w which is basically what happens in the story you know, as a whole. But it is not as complex as in this case. Uh, <coughs> I, I I remember that in the, the fall of the house of Richard, the short story, something very supernatural happens, and the house just gets swallowed by the hell, by the dirt, something like that. Uh, I I remember I have the image of. Uh, of a swamp sucking down the house, something like that. In the series, it's a little bit different, but it gets this spirit of the decay of a family. First, I thought it was a metaphor. The fall is the metaphor of the decay, but it was literal. A fall, <laughs> literally, uh, literally, a literal fall. But uh, I, I think that's one first connections that I made when I watched it. I think that uh, the, the Colombian writer, uh, Gabriel Garcia Marques, he maybe got the idea of some kind of a disappearing of a household by the, I don't know, the turbulence of some, some things, some time, some events uh, that happens in, with within a family eh? uh, and I think he, he used this idea it's not it's not a, a, a plagiarism uh, it's more like a, a inspiration for the the end of the 100 years of solitude by Gabriel Garcia Marx and in this this classical story uh, by uh, this this 
Colombian writer that is the, the most rich president of the uh, fantastic realism and uh, the, the, the households uh, the, the whole city actually but it's a small city that was commanded by a family it gets swallowed by the dirt by the insects by I don't know what else uh, it disappear in the end and I think uh, the, 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 the idea a theme of the disappearance maybe uh, had be had he had influenced him to to this writing I, I don't know maybe but that's uh, one connection that I made you feel free to not make this connection to disagree uh, well I will comment uh, first uh, about the the, the episode uh, each episode of the series I hope you have watched since you came to this video probably you got interested by the title and the, the, the each episode has one death at least at least one death which recalls to the names of uh, others short stories by Edgar Allan Poe so there is the the death of the the daughter uh, the the youngest daughters if I'm not mistaken and she she is killed by a, a, a ape an ape uh, a, a monkey a chimpanzee and of course the this this death has reference to the the short story uh, murders in the room or which in the episode is has the same name uh, in the original story by Edgar Allan Poe, uh, the, the Rue Morgue is a, a, a street where some, some murder happened and nobody knows what happened. And so the detective Dupin, which in this story, the Fall of House of Usher, the series, Dupin is a prosecutor that goes along uh, with the conversation with the, the, the Roderick. Usher, uh, the whole story, which is the, the base of the, the short story, The Fall of the House of Usher. And uh, in, in The Murder of the Room or the short story, Dupin discovers that the, the murder that happened, it was a very visceral murder, murder with very bloody gore and unhuman in some way. And everybody was thinking that was some more someone else, uh, a person, some person. And what is funny, I remember uh, the short story is uh, everyone thinks the the murder was committed by a, a foreign person, uh, but a foreign person that speak a language that the the the, the witness doesn't know. Like uh, I'm Brazilian, I don't speak Japanese, so I think the murder was speaking Japanese or the witness is French and doesn't speak Russian and thinks that the, the, the murder was speaking Russian. So the, the, the drawing of this witness, this uh, narratives, Dupin says that uh, actually it wasn't a person, it was uh, some kind of animal. So they discovered that this was an ape. Uh, Rangutan, I think, in the short story. So, is they 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 change the things, and they made the ape of the the, the episode of the murder in the room morgue being a, a ape, an ape that was experimented in with the 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 procedures in the heart that the family was developing, and and then when she finds out the, the 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 cage where the monkeys are the apes are she got murdered by one of them that is very visceral too uh, that's one case i, I want uh comments one thing that I, I find very interesting that it seems that netflix is kind of obsessed with the team of criticizing the the pharmaceutical industry they they presented this year uh, uh, a series that was called 
Pain Business, I think. I think that's the name with uh, Matt Broderick. And they, they reproduce in some way the case of the Purdue company, uh, the company that produce an uh, opium, opioid, a medicine that is for pain and cause addiction to many people and many people die. And this story, the follow has a usher. The ushers own a company, a pharmaceutical company called Fortunata, and they make an opioid that caused many deaths and there is this other movie recently uh, released in Netflix with Chris Evans uh, it's called something of the pain 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 hustlers pain hustler I think is that the name which is that same story as right? a pharmaceutical company that pushes a medicine that is addicted based on opium yeah, and heroin basically and m people die and so on and they spend money bribing doctors to, to give a speech recommending the, the medicine so it's funny because uh, uh, in, in it seems that's a recurrent theme this year in the Netflix I don't know well uh, the second murder in another episode that I remember is the episode of the cats the black cats in the short story by Edgar Allan Poe, the black cat is uh, some kind of a being that curse a man, a photographer I think, I don't know, uh, maybe I remember another movie, but curse a man and then the man murders someone and puts the, the corpses, uh, the body in the wall, in the wall. And the cat is like the I think it's the cat the it's that the, the victim's cat, and it reproduces <laughs> baby cats inside the, the where the carp the the body is, and he he pursues the the cats, uh, tortures the cats, and some some and some some somewhere in the story, he hits the wall with a, a stick or a cane some kind and the cat begins to make noises despite of the cat had been murdered had been killed before the, the original cat so the, the baby cats start to make noises and kind of a uh, uh, tells everyone that the body is there in the, the version of the series the cat is a substitute cat as a cat that was replaced by the the the, the victim and uh, one of the usher's sons uh, because he accidentally he doesn't remember was in a party killed the the original cat that was owned by his boyfriend and he kills the cat and throws away and goes to the shelter to animal shelter and brings another cat. Of course, the other cat is cursed. Yeah? It was put there by the Beth, I think. Uh, the, the, the character played by Carla Gugino. Some, some people may interpret as the devil, some interpret as death or the raven. That's another, uh, another Adidas and Poe story, the raven or the crow, uh, the raven, the coral, and she puts the cat, the evil cat, evil cat, in the house of the, 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 the victim and starts to bring him uh, dead animals, dead birds, dead rats, and he begins to, to have hallucinations, he's a drug abuser, that's, that's for sure, and in the, the limits, he calls the woman from the shelter, which is death. Yeah? And uh, she like uh, uh, shows to him that he was doing the wrong thing. He was, he was cursed all the time because that's the, the thing of the story. Yeah? The, the, the death made a pact with the Usher brothers, Usher siblings. Roderick and Madeline, they would have 
40, 50 years of perfect, perfect richness without disease, without problems. But somewhere uh, in the future, they all will die. All the bloodline of the wishers will die in the house of wishers will fall. That's the, the curse. So when the, the uh, Leon, when Napoleon, Leon, he, he finds out that the cat is pursuing him because his curse, he breaks the walls like in the original story. In the walls there is the body of the original cat, I think. And he sees a hallucination of the body of the death, of the woman that plays death. And the cat is in the balcony, he runs the balcony and falls, I don't know how many stairs, how many floors, and dies. So it's a horrible, horrible deaths. And I don't think I'll be able to comment all of them. But it's funny that they made the connection between the short stories by Edgar Allan Poe, which are short stories that are not connected with one another. Must, but they made this connection with the stories from the black cat to Mother's the Rumor, the the Raven and the the Pit and the Pendle and there's another one. I uh, I, I forgot, I forgot. There's another one. Ah, there's a reference to a, a, a story of the, the global cir circle, circle global travel that was somewhere made in the end of the 19th century, which presents the, the past of the character played by Mark Hamill brilliantly by Mark Hamill. Uh, if you don't know Mark Hamill, he, is, he was, uh, he's famous for the role of Luke Skywalker and uh, he also drew the brilliantly to the voice of the Joker and this is a reference to the story of the, the circle global circle global travel uh, uh, something like that it's a, a travel that goes from one pole to another from North Pole to the South Pole and um, don't, there is the Fall of the House of Usher, the Black Cat, the Murder of the Rumor, the Raven, the Pit and the Pendle, and there is there is two more, I think, two more stories. Oh, the the Golden Beetle, the Golden Beetle, two, which is completely different. The short story the, uh, about the Golden Beetle in the uh, Allan Poe's short story is a story about a treasure hunt uh, and, and codes and, and a book that was found. And in the in the series, they changed to the symbol of a a vain brands of products, very expensive products by uh, for for skincare that one of the daughters of the house of Usher, Usher, she was selling and she was betraying and she basically killed herself with mirrors. It's very, very graphic the way she dies. It's one of the best deaths, uh, cinematically speaking. It was very visual and the use of mirrors was very well done. Um, I think that's it. Uh, my comments uh, go this far. It's the video is about 18 minutes. I will end here. I would like you to share this video, comments, uh, subscribe to the channel if you're not, ring the bell, take a look at the description for the, the links that I present there. Take a look to my news book that sell today you can buy today it's in Portuguese but you can buy these other books too you can purchase in the links that are in the description and also support the channel if you can okay so I am ending here I finish I'm finished here till next Wednesday with a new, a new video in English 
Bye bye.